All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Marcus, and you're watching Dame Chansa Vlogs. We are starting the day off here at my grandma's pad. We got another install video for you guys. What is that? <laughs> uh, another K Tune product here. If you guys can see that, K Tune. If you're watching the video, hit me up, please. I love a sponsor. I see you, baby. Shaking that ass. So, first off, we got a K Tune sticker there. And let's just get right into this. You guys ready? So, um. Voila, guys. Look at this. Another perfect part. K Tune just makes quality parts that I fucking love. And they look amazing. And they feel amazing. And the color's amazing. Check that out, guys. So just uh, front camber kits. They do come with um, six Allen head bolts from the bottom side, so they're more easy to adjust. And uh, yeah, you don't have to be from the top undoing it. Just do it from the bottom, camber your shit in, and you'll be fine. Also, um, this uh, bushing is not like regular uh, OEM bushings. These are like uh, squished together, I guess you could say, instead of a, a hard ball. And they're uh, hard rubber as well. So um, they're, they tend to last a little bit longer. Also, you come with their castle nut, and all this shit feels really quality. They do come with the hardware as well, so before I start uh, jacking up the car, because there's no point in showing you guys the other uh, camera arm, uh, they do come with the hardware, so um, they go through the arm here, and then they uh, mount into the uh, shock tower. All right, guys, so let's get this uh, install started here. Oops. Let's get this install started real quick. We're gonna start off by removing the front tires. Set those lug nuts aside. Okay guys, so let me show you guys what's up. Um, uninstalling this is really easy. It's just a castle nut up here. Open up this hood. Okay, now we got to remove uh, this bolt here, this bolt here. Get in there, bitch. Okay. Oh, yeah. Had enough power. Perfect. Okay. So these are loose in here. Let's take these off here, just like so. We're going to have to hammer this shit out here. Let's find a hammer. I have like two or three hammers. Found it. Okay. Found the hammer. Now I'm gonna hammer this shit away. There it is. Knock it loose. Okay, so let's open our packaging up. Slide that in. Ah, kidding. And then put your nut on, of course. Get your nut on. Get your nut on. forget to tighten these up guys anyway we're gonna get this on here just like this shit 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 Sherlock okay and that's your control arm install right there so like beforehand and you just throw that in there tighten them up and you're good to go Okay, so those two nuts, they go straight through here. I showed you guys earlier, we gotta loosen these here. That's it. Control arm is in. Look at that fucking beauty right there. Look at that. Move this out the way. Okay. All right, so now let's just tighten these up real fast, which is a 17. So uh, 
check this out. We went and got hard race uh, lower control arm bushings here. We've needed those for a long time, guys. What I was using before was shit. We got the driver's side knuckle here. We're gonna get it all put back together real fast, as fast as we can. Get the other side in, put this bitch back on the floor, and uh, hopefully everything's okay. Fingers crossed everything goes well from here on out. So, this right here just goes into the knuckle just like that. And uh, it's easy right now to get your um, axle in as well. So, um, get your axle in right now, like so. And this has a spline to it. Okay, that's in. Now we're gonna get the upper control arm. Okay, now that shit's in. Okay, so we got our castle nut up here on, so that shit don't go nowhere. Now, we got our tie rod. I'm gonna set this bitch in real quick, like so. We're pretty much done on this side. So, we're gonna move on to the other side right now. I'm gonna finish putting the rest of the suspension on this side, so. Let me just do that for you guys real quick so you guys don't forget how everything goes. So let's get this uh, brake line out of our way here. We'll bring it and put it somewhere right here. So that should hold for it. You guys saw previously the K2 coilovers. So let's put this bad boy back in. Just like so. Get that top hat secured. Just like that. Just like that. All right, next, our fork. Add in just like this. Come on, bitch. Yes. Just like so. Then we've got a 14 millimeter bolt here. Put it through. Just like that. So. Then we're gonna get our nut here, our bolt and nut that goes through. Okay, back it in. All right, and that's all done. But that's this side, guys. I'm gonna get the other side done on my own time. So, um, just so you guys know, all the suspension is done. Once I'm done putting everything back together, I'll get back to you guys. So, okay, guys. So this side here is done. Take how, take a look at that fucking like changes drastically the look of like everything. Look, check that out. So new suspension there, new tie rod here. The look under here, new ball joint is in there too. It's gonna be amazing, guys. All right, guys. So there it is. Driver's side, passenger side are both call completed. Catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.